trees communicate with each other. They even have a form of altruism where they help each other. They help give certain species of tr- their own species more nutrients, right? They understand which tree belongs to their species, right? Also, if some animal is eating for a particular leaf, that tree will send, I think, a gas signal to the other trees to warn them animals are coming. When they get that gas signal, it, the, the, base, the trees basically produce this bitter resin or something. And when animals try and eat, it, it, it's bitter. So this book is so amazing. It just showed me like, wow, trees are living organisms. And you know what? I'm not a beach person. I'm a forest person. You know, sometimes I say to the kids, beach or forest. Or I say to people, beach or forest. And sometimes people choose beach. Sometimes I'm more of a forest. You know why? Because when I walk into a forest, bro, it's almost like a mystical experience. Like you're in an organism. You're in a live thing that's talking, that's breathing. You know the hadith about the tree that cried? Yeah? Allahu Akbar. Trees talk to each other. You know, one would even argue that trees feel pain. Right? They send signals to each other. They communicate. They understand which tree belongs to their species. They have altruism. From what I remember, and double check this out for yourself in the book, trees sacrifice themselves for other trees. Right? That's phenomenal and amazing, yeah?